Betty, no barky. Okay, you stay, girl. Stay. Okay, hi everybody. So, um, we just got back, well, a little while ago from a really nice long drive and so this may or may not be the footage right before this, I don't know. But we went to go pick up the awesome Manfrotto tripod that I am currently using to record this part of the vlog. And so the really funny thing was, it's a gorgeous day. It was finally 26 degrees today, absolutely beautiful. We put the top of the roof back, we brought Teddy along with us and he was loving it, all the fresh air, because he just loves his fresh air. And I forgot my sunglasses. So there's a little story here. I just ordered new sunglasses from Zenny. This is not an ad, it's not sponsored or paid or anything like that. It just happens to be where I've found my frames lately that I like. These ones are from Zenny as well. And I also have a pair of readers that are pretty much exactly the same, but in a different color. Anyway, so <clears throat> what happened was we went to Hawaii back in October and I had prescription sunglasses and I was wearing them in the water without a strap and they fell off and they went down, down, down into the coral reef. And unfortunately, Fortunately, unfortunately, um, there was a lovely gentleman swimming nearby and he was, you know, treasure hunting and also looking at the massive sea turtles that were nearby. And boy, they were so cool. They were so cool. And anyway, <clears throat> and he noticed that the three of us kept looking around and, and we were kind of, you know, leaning down, looking at the water and whatnot. And he swam over to us and he said, did you lose something? And so once we explained, it was just a wave caught me off guard. I mean, I swim with my sunglasses on all the time, but unfortunately this time I lost them and they're down in the coral reef somewhere, still in Honolulu, unless they've washed up on the beach. So he tried to find them, he couldn't. It was very nice of him. He said that sometimes things do wash up at the end of the day, depending on where it fell and if it got stuck in the rocks or not, of course. But um, he tried and tried and he, he couldn't find them for us. And of course we weren't gonna ask him to keep looking forever. So it's been since October. I didn't bother getting new prescription sunglasses because let's face it, I would hardly need them over the winter in Vancouver. It's not like the winter time in Ontario where I grew up and you still get the bright blinding sunlight and it's even worse sometimes because it's bouncing off the snow. No, this was, you know, a gray, very gray winter and I had very little need for my prescription sunglasses. But now, but since summer was coming and we knew it would arrive eventually, <laughs> I decided to go ahead and order another pair. And Zenny is like clearly, if any of you know clearly, it's, um, it's nice and um, lower budget, um, but still good quality. It's just that you don't get the personal touch, the in-store service. And so anyway, I had ordered them. They arrived literally yesterday, but I haven't had sunglasses for so long that when we went out on our drive today, I totally forgot I had them. So now I'm gonna open them with you. La da! Zenny! And this always cracks me up. They, they always send a little eh, to measure your pupillary distance. Dude, if, if we just ordered glasses, we, we don't need this right now. Unless, of course, we ordered our glasses and they're so very wrong for our pupillary distance. Anyway. That's cool because it reminds me of 3D glasses. All right, here we go. The moment of truth. I love this too, they, they staple it closed. I dropped it inside the bag. 
Oh, there it is. Okay, because I was just going to comment on how they staple it, and yet it's in with your glasses. So you don't want the staple to scratch your glasses, right? They always send it with a cloth wrapped around it. So that's awesome because we go through a ton of these. I mean, they're not, you can wash them, right? Just eventually they get kind of worn down. Nice little plastic arm coverage. <gasps> oh, oh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh my God, this is the best cloth I've ever gotten. Can you see that? <laughs> it's a bunny at a laptop. And here we are. So they're pretty much exactly the same as you might see. Let's see how they go. Am I cool? No. <laughs> Anybody who asks that is not cool. Yeah, so far everything looks good. They're the same prescription from the last ones anyway. I did get my eyes checked a little while ago to make sure that this prescription hadn't changed significantly enough. That was still a few months ago because I did feel like maybe my prescription had changed a little bit, but he said no. So that was kind of a wasted appointment, but hey, whatever. It's eye health, right? It's important. This is the same prescription as this. Yeah, this would have been good to have on today because <laughs> my eyes felt kind of crusty when we got home. They always do when we're in the Jeep and the wind's blowing in them. Um, but I always wear glasses anyway, so that doesn't matter. So, yay! This is cute. Inside it says, trendy, not spendy. And they do have a really good selection of frames, honestly. A lot of nice adventurous ones. I kind of stick to my my favorite, my tried and true style. But yeah, so I don't know. Hopefully you guys found that interesting and yeah, see you later. 